So you're thinking about living in Ashland. Well, all the seasons are great, but winter is an especially cool time in Ashland. There are three reasons, primarily the celebrations, the special eats, and the outdoor recreation. So special celebrations. In Ashland, there's always a time to celebrate. All the seasons have special things. We've got the 4th of July parade. We've got the fun Halloween parade for the kids. In the winter, it's the Festival of Lights parade. That's when the plaza lights up. The people all come downtown. It's gonna be cold, so you better believe there's gonna be some amazing hot cocoa. And you're gonna to wanna to hang out and just kind of be around a part of the community. It's a special night. There are always some floats with some beautiful lights on them and some performances from live musicians. It's a cool parade. It's just a wonderful night. It's just a beautiful celebration. Another great celebration in Ashland is New Year's. It's always awesome to go around to different performance venues and enjoy some New Year's libations. The wineries nearby like Bella Friori and Pascal do special New Year's events as well as bars downtown like the Brick Room. New Year's is a fun time in Ashland. This is a great time to hang out with friends and go do something special. It's a wonderful place to experience the new year. They also have special plays. For instance, OSF has done a special play this year called, it's called Christmas Carol, which is a really fun show that highlights some of the joy around the season. It's just a really cool thing. And special events always happen year round in Ashland, but the holidays in winter is especially a nice time to go. Another great treat in the winter in Ashland, especially for a foodie like me, are the special eats. Winchester Inn and the Alchemy Restaurant and Bar does a special thing called the Dickens Feast, which is this wonderful meal with vocal quartet. They're singing songs and it's a fun time. And unfortunately for the last couple of years, we haven't had it, but it's gonna make a strong comeback, I guarantee you. You can find me there because I love that evening. It was a tradition for our family and really loved every minute of it. You also find special seasonal brews at Caldera and you'll find special eats at the Growler Guys and other areas in town. But one special new tradition happens at the Ro Roasting Company, or Roco as we call it, where they're now hosting a really cool holiday bazaar. It's a wonderful time, you can come. They've got some of the best coffee in town. They've got drinks, they've got some specials too, like the champagne with some ice cream in it. I don't know what it's called, Amy, but I love it, Amy. So check it out, Roco's really cool, especially in the holiday season. But the real star of the holiday season is the outdoor recreation. We know that's what everyone's here for, especially Mount Ashland. Well, this year it's been amazing. At one point, they had over 100 inches of snow in 10 days, setting a record, which means the conditions for skiing and snowboarding are prime. Ashland is a great value. A lift ticket is around 60 bucks for the full day, and for children six and under, it's free. It's a wonderful opportunity, and if you plan ahead and you're thinking about it, you can get a season pass for a reduced rate. Mount Ashland does a great job of keeping the road open. They do a great job of building community. It's just a really cool, special place. Go spend a day on the mountain, you'll never regret it, I'm sure. Snowshoeing is also an incredible opportunity in Ashland. You can get out just about anywhere, really, and enjoy some snow. But some of my favorites are, well, go up to Crater Lake, because if you've never seen Crater Lake in the snow, wow. For some reason, the lake is bluer than usual. I don't know if it has to do with the reflection, but try and get a sunny day and get out there, wear sunglasses, of course, and go snowshoeing. You can rent the snowshoes from the park there and you can walk around. It's really an awesome, awesome place. Maybe you don't want to go to Crater Lake. Maybe that's too far of a drive for you. We'll go check out Howard Prairie. Go around Hyatt Lake area. There's some wonderful hikes and some wonderful places you can go snowshoe out in the Cascade National Monument. There's really, you can almost not go wrong in the snowshoeing department. It's really awesome. But perhaps one of the coolest outdoor recreation, I don't know if it's really outdoors, recreation opportunities is the skating rink in Ashland. For $5 for an adult ticket, $4 for youth, and kids under five are free, you can go and you can do ice skating. I mean, how cool is that? Right downtown, right next to the plaza, they, the city offers an ice skating rink. It's a great place to go hang. Maybe you wanna go on a date, or maybe you just wanna like have a great family time. It's a great thing to do. Be sure to get your phones out, make sure they're charged so you can take videos of little ones falling and laughing and, and just enjoy yourselves. It's a great thing. Listen, there's no shortage of things to do in Ashland in the winter. I know that I haven't hit everything. Would you please tell me some of your favorites down below in the comments and subscribe to this video because I'm gonna do all the seasons and it's gonna be a lot of fun. We'd love to have you along as part of the community. Tell me what you love about living in Ashland.